out the two teams. It's his stage tonight. Um, you'll probably see him making the runs from behind Ali McCoy. Coping well on the pitch despite the uh, constant. Oh, David Robertson has got sent off for that. So with the way, with it, with the man advantage, they haven't got the goal. Well, Celtic letting McCall get away. McCoy, he scored right on the 45 minutes against all the odds. of extravagant celebration. McCoy is almost in tears of joy and disbelief. The ten men have taken the lead at Hampden Park. A lovely ball by Stuart McCall. Just nicely weighted. Ali takes it first time. He just gets a hand to it, Gordon Marshall. Very unlucky not to see that pass the post. Good cool play by Stuart. Goes to shoot, squares a lovely pass. Just adjusted his feet and a lovely finish inside the post. Sensational beginning with David Robertson sent off after six minutes and a sensational conclusion. Celtic got themselves into difficulties very much of their own making. And McCaw went to tackle tenaciously, having got the ball, delivered it perfectly. And Ali McCoy doing what comes instinctively and incredibly at half time at Hamden. It's Celtic nil. Rangers won. Don't worry though, remember, Ali McCoist has scored the first goal by a Rangers player against Celtic in the Scottish Cup since Tom Forsyth back in 1973. So precious for Rangers. Every passing second taking them closer and closer an extraordinary victory on a terrible night but that will not worry those behind the left-hand goal we're really into the last few seconds and uh, Celtic will keep going right until the final whistle so um, Rangers can't afford to relax now never write off Rangers a sensational semi-final success 84 minutes with 10 men to Put the old enemy out of the Scottish Cup at long, long last. And uh, into the 1992 final in the second half in which often as he stopped shots, the frame of the goal came to his rescue as well on three occasions. But moments like this are very, very rare. And hardened football people like Walter Smith are absolutely delighted and understandably so this triumph rippling with character and courage Celtic already off the pitch they hit the post with O'Neill hit the bar with McStay and a header from Craney was turned onto the bar from Andy Gorham they might have seen when John Brown appeared to bring down John Collins but Ali McCoy yet again has been a marvel for Rangers. Nigel Blackman, the man of the match. And